When I was growing up, recycling was, was sort of boring, it was irrelevant, it was kind of optional. You kind of, it was a bit figure-wagging, you know, you'd, you'd do it if you really cared. These days, it's absolutely vital, and I think what they're doing here is, is quite visionary in a way. It's not, you know, normally, you take food waste and you make it into compost, and that's all very lovely. But they're doing something quite futuristic here, and they're actually extracting the energy out of it. And what's amazing is that this stuff, it's like a massive stomach. It's a huge stomach in a, in a shed. Who here has ever farted? Put your hand up. So, how do you build a fart? Bringing kids to somewhere like this is a genius idea because what's happening to the food waste that we chuck away normally is it doesn't just disappear into landfill, it gets digested. <laughs> what happens in here is it gets turned into farts and poo. Now, you can say what you like about, about being polite about, about food, but that's what happens inside you. So at the same time as showing them that they should be recycling and this is what should happen to our waste materials, they are learning about what's happening inside their own bodies and about why they eat food and what people are always banging on about when they talk about energy and foods. I think it's not just a great way to teach about recycling, it's a great way to teach about nutrition and health and digestion and concepts like obesity because the energy coming out of this is the energy in the food that we, that we get to be, enable us to, to run around anyway. So getting them inspired at this age is, is an absolutely perfect idea. Being able to see somewhere like this is very inspiring because this, I think, shows people that it's real, it's vital, it's something that's happening that you can do on a very, very simple level to, to change the world and make it a little bit of a better place. This is about sustainability and action. There's something quite magical going on inside there, and I, and I find that personally incredibly inspiring. Okay.